I mean, it, <laughs> it looks ridiculous. I literally just ripped the face off a of pearl bird and stuck it to my own head. All right, we are back in Outward. When we last left Jim, uh, Jim had a pretty good day. Uh, we defeated all the bandits in the Van Devil Fortress with only uh, a minor setback being thrown in prison uh, for just a short time. Uh, but we did manage to defeat all the bandits and bring news back to Burak that we defeated said bandits. Uh, and for that, he provided us this nifty helm uh, that I'm sure will strike fear into the hearts of the Alpha Deer uh, that I intend to completely eradicate from the Enrakar Forest. Uh, in favor of getting their horns from them as they make great bleed traps, which I have fallen in love with. But, so, in the last episode, when we brought news to Burak, I fully expected him to say, uh, a la classic video game fashion, uh, hey, you've got to get back to Berg immediately. Risa needs your help, and you have to get there in two days' time. But he didn't say that yet. I haven't been back over there, and it is completely within the realm of possibility that he is going to say, as I step out the front gate, oh, by the by, let me get, let me catch a quick word with you. Um, but he hasn't said that yet. Uh, so, the intent, uh, is to go, uh, around Cherisonese, uh, and just drop in on some of the folks who pushed us around, uh, at the beginning and middle of the game. Wow, I never realized there was a, um, a fish weather vane up there. That's pretty damn cool. Um, so, very specifically, I'd like to drop in on the troglodytes, uh, and say hello, see what they've been up to, and say hello to the skeleton, pirate skeleton, uh, that really, really gave me a bad time in one of the episodes. Now, my pride will probably go with Before the Fall. I had a good episode, <laughs> had a good time in the last episode, uh, you know, not getting trounced too badly, but... Uh, it is usually a week in between my recording these, I like to record them on the weekends. And so it's been a full week since I played this game, and I'm absolutely ready <laughs> for it to be a nightmare. Now, I'm, uh, dilly-dallying here a little bit because I was doing some chores before hitting record, just making sure Jim was ready to go out and adventure, and I came down here to get water, and it says, gather rancid water, drink rancid water. Um, and I did recall uh, from a prior playthrough, uh, having to talk to somebody who I think is this guy right here, who's gonna give me a task, uh, to fix whatever's wrong with this and return water to Cherzo, which I think is a fine start, and hopefully will, uh, solidify our need to stay in Cherisonese for a little while without Burak bugging me. So, let's see. Uh, we'll talk to Edios von Venus, the engineer. Hold it right there, Jim. Some dirty rat has done sabotaged our water purifier. Uh, if you little nipper want to get something, some to drink, boil that stinking water first. Yeah, so I already did that. I actually got, um, river water so I'd get salt out of it. Uh, so we're all taken care of there. Um, that little saboteur smashed out the water pur purifier's power coils. Those were some fancy schmancy magic parts right there. Won't be able to get my hands on those. Ah, son, everybody needs two power coils! I need two power coils, man! You don't- I only have one! Oh, boy. All right. Look, Nipper, if you find two power coils during your big ol' adventure, can you bring them here? I'll fix my machine my machine right up, and she'll be purring and pumping in no time. Yeah. Fine. Fine. Take my power coils. Uh, yeah, inside of a bandit camp in Cherson East, where I got that cool halberd, there's a door that needs two power coils, and inside of that door, I know through a, um, a glitch, uh, an exploit that has been patched out of the game, in the intervening time since I've used it, uh, that you can get inside of that door, and inside of that door is this very backpack. I suppose, saying that now, I realize I don't really need that backpack. Um, so I guess if we find another one, he can have the two. But hopefully the need- you know what, one other thing I do want to check, I am like, digging where Jim's heading, but... I really would love some better armor, and I, I, you know, I don't know if that's gonna mean buying it, but I figured I'd just stop and check and see what he's got. I mean, we also could think about making armor. I'd have to buy something to learn how to craft it. Actually, there's- Oh, whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Yes, I want that. Tripwire trap. Yes, the trap itself. I want that. Wow, I'm glad I stopped. Alright. Alright, we're gonna go through here without talking to Burak. 
Hopefully he doesn't stop us. Man, you couldn't give me that axe? Oh man, that axe would have been cool. I mean, I like my axe and all, but yours looks a little cooler. Yeah, whatever. Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. We'll be happy with what we got. I got a cool helm. I'm happy with it. I'll tell you what I do want to get. And you know, maybe we'll maybe we'll do a little test here. We'll do a little a little test of our of our prowess with Oh. Oh, that's right. When we walk in Ah, ah shit. Nope. They're running this way. Don't run at me because I don't want you fighting me until I'm ready for it. Uh, I was going to test out my new bow abilities on one of these stupid pearl birds that even the hyena is annoyed about. We're definitely going to clear them out of here in case I have to come back here limping. Oh my goodness. Seriously, come on guys. Yeah, so I wanted to check out if my, my new bow skills and my new bow might make a difference with this, uh, danged... What am I hearing? I'm hearing them fighting. I don't see them fighting. Wow, they're- they're chasing each other all the way out to there. My goodness. And now the bandits are involved. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Alright, whatever. Let's see if we can catch up with him over one of this guy. Yeah, there we go. We'll try to catch up with him right here. Are you mourning your lost loved one? No, I'm gonna definitely kill you. Nice. Well, whatever. <laughs> Switch back, we'll grab some eggs. And meat. Nice, that's good. I didn't realize I dropped meat. I can make jerky. I do like jerky. I was gonna see how close to one-shotting these goddamn pearl birds I could get, because... That would absolutely be an episode. Just clearing the entire countryside of all these damned pearl birds. <laughs> Alright, there was- there still is a Wendigo here. I'm not gonna fight him. I'm not that brave yet. Oh, God. There's bandits here, and I can't- I don't want to fight him so close to this Wendigo, but I want to fight them. Where did he go? Oh, he's right there. Do you think we could aggro him and get him over here? To kill them? Oh, man. Look at him. That's horrifying. It's just- it's creepy. Alright, well, I'm not that much more worried about, uh, these guys now. Let's do this. Uh... Uh, yeah, we'll take you. Whoops. There's one. He drops his... He loses almost all his health. I drop my stuff. Uh, we might as well rage it up. And just take care of him. What? Oh, I broke through. Nice. Didn't capitalize on it, though. Oh, did he get me? He did. Ah, oh, they're both ready to die. Oh, you bastard. Oh! Son of a, son of a. Well, hey, that's fine. I'm okay with it. Alright, I think we're gonna go to the troglodytes first and see if our, uh, hubris is well-founded. If they make such quick work of us as they have last time, um, we may just, uh, run with our tail between our legs. <laughs> think of something else. If we manage them, then I think, uh, Skeleton, depending on how long it takes to kill him, I can't imagine it takes more than a few minutes if we do well. Uh, Skeleton might be next in order. Alright, we're gonna try, oops, this guy. Oh ho 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 ho! Okay. Okay. He had full health. I'm pretty sure he did. We may test that again. Oh, that was weird. I was carrying my... <gasps> what is that? Movement speed 15%! Here, hold on a second. What the fuck is this? Alright. This costs mana, stamina, movement speed. Oh, it's got no resistances whatsoever and it's not very durable. <laughs> Well, let's put it on for... I mean, does it literally make us faster here? Not really. Does it make me swing faster? I can't tell. <laughs> I mean... It, <laughs> it looks ridiculous. 
<laughs> I literally just ripped the face off a pearl bird and stuck it to my own head. <laughs> Fucking Jim. Gruesome. All right, I think these guys are this way. Uh, yeah, okay, we're not gonna go into troglodyte world with that on, but, oh man, we might play around with that. Just for the hell of it. That is, that's, oh wait, no, no, no. It's down here, right? We're looking for that troglodyte cave, by the by, if I didn't mention. Well, what do we have here? Two hyenas and what is this, a dead hyena? Did I loot it already? I must have killed that on the way here. All right. Well, guess what? Oh, nice. Ah, shit. Shit. Forgot to take off my bag and it's too late now. Did he get me? No. I keep diving with my bag on, but that's okay. We're just circling to get our stamina back. And then do one of these. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Nice. Very cool. Oh, Jesus. It's frozen and frightening. All right, we might should stop and make some, uh... Oh, he's like, sitting. Heal. Good boy. Man, I know this game doesn't have companions. Like, I get- it is co-op. But it would've been cool if they were like, you can have a hyena come with you. You can get a skill that lets you tame wild animals, lesser wild animals, and they can accompany you until they die. They are not invincible. Maybe for Outward too. I've got a fair bit of money, um, but we're gonna need it because if I recall correctly, the house in Berg that you can get is like three grand. All right, here we go. We are... My rage lasts longer, so we'll do rage first. I love it, Jim. I love how rageful you are. Drop our bag. Hopefully this stays unsheathed. And here we go! Alright, you friggin' trogs. Stupid jerk trogs. You know, we may postpone buying the house to, um, whenever it comes up to get the next... The next amount of, uh, health that we're allowed to get. Oh, uh, I can't with you guys. Why are you so healthy? Whoops. Swing on him! Do it! Jim! I need you to do this! No, there it is. No, get him! Get out of here! He's got nothing. He's only got this thing and I can't... Okay, got him. Alright, I did that the dumbest way possible. We're taking a drink. Of our health book. I think we got him. Okay, that was terrible, but I got him. And I'm alive. And we're gonna take our antidote. Of, for poison. Okay. Alright. Everything's fine. We're gonna go get our bag. <laughs> We're gonna come back inside. All right, I did panic very badly, but Jim's got enough good stuff on him. Got enough effects and enough gear that that worked out. I'm claiming it as a victory. It was a victory. <laughs> My goodness, I'll tell you what. There, ne well, there needs to be a, we'll take that for sure. Eh, yeah, we'll go ahead and take that. There needs to be a power coil in here. Uh, let's see what they were hiding. Barely anything of value. Alright. Increases your ethereal damage and resistances. Awesome. That's good to have. Alright, I'm not heading back. Alright, skeletons can't bleed. I don't think I have anything for bludgeon. I bet that I bet that thing I just took apart would have done a bludgeon. Whoops. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go to the skeleton. We're gonna do it. We're going to him. We're gonna go say hi. All right, so it's up that way, I think. I'm not going to try to go a different way. My recollection is it's up that pathway and to the right. And, uh, yeah, we're just going to set a bunch of traps for the skeleton. And, uh, I don't know, hope for the best. Uh, like, do we think... Skeletons can probably be shocked. Do you think they can be iced? Maybe we'll try ice on the skeleton. Maybe that's what we'll do. 
Yeah, it seems like extra blue. You know what it probably is, is that it's, I spent so much time in the damn winter that I didn't, um, realize I didn't get to see any of this stuff. Wow. Stunning. Really nice looking game sometimes, you know? Okay, confused him. Nice. Ah, oh, this is like favorite. This is the best. <laughs> All right, this fucking skeleton is done for. Oh god, he better be. He better be. I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh god, if this skeleton kills me, I'm gonna be very disappointed. <laughs> We've got everything we could possibly need to kill this guy. We're gonna try Frost. He's a skeleton, right? Maybe that'll, like, freeze his bones in place. I'm like, he's probably not susceptible to bleed. Okay, here's what I'm really hoping. I'm hoping that it's been enough time that he's reset. Because if he's right inside the goddamn door, this is gonna change everything. But... Ugh, we shall see. I don't think I've been out long enough that I'm gonna get tired. So I think we have enough time to, like, deal with this, however... However much of my head I need to bang against the wall for however long I need to do that. <gasps> what? All right. Well, uh, you know, there's a part of me that doesn't want to risk this, but there's another part of me that's like, fuck the skeleton. Because I have a power coil back in the chest at the at the lighthouse. Um, We're going to at least take a look inside. That's what we're going to do. We are going to go inside with our bag. We are going to sneak. We'll get closer and sneak. Pirate's hideout. Hopefully he's not right at the front friggin' door. Please have reset all the way to where you're supposed to be. He did. Okay. Here's what we're doing. We are going to try to not arouse suspicion with this fellow. We are going to... Oh, we got six traps. Dude, you're done for. Do you understand the kind of done for you are? After all the heck you put me through? No, 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 no. He didn't cut. I walked all the way up to him last time. No, don't come over here. Don't do it. I'm getting out of here. Oh my god. I walked all the way over to him last time. I, like, literally the first time we met him, I walked all the way up to him and was like, can I talk to him? And he wouldn't even talk to us. Alright. Give him a second to just think about what he's done. Uh Here's what we'll do. We'll drink. Is he ethereal? No, he's not ethereal. I want to set traps so I don't want to walk in with my stuff, like, my rage and everything already set up. But just in case it goes wrong, we'll rage up. All right, let's see. Let's see if he walked all the way to the front door. He doesn't seem to be coming at me. I can't see, so I gotta be careful. He's just kicked back. Do you see that? Shit. All right, let's do it. We're gonna do it. Oh, that didn't even do anything to him. Maybe he is ethereal. Is he ethereal? I don't like it! <laughs> don't be ethereal. No, you don't hit me. Don't ever hit me. Ah, oh, he got me good, too. I don't think I'm doing any damage to him. He might be ethereal. I may have to do one thing real quick. Man, he doesn't give up. Here's what we're doing. I'm gonna get off of him. I'm just going to, uh, coat my weapon. Oh, uh, I'm not doing any damage to him. Oh, if he heals up while I'm out here, I'm gonna be very unhappy. I gotta get my bag. I can't not get my bag. I have to get my bag. What is this guy made out of? What in the hell? Alright, we're gonna try this. There we go. There's one. Do I have anything I can put on me? Oh, I, I have my... My bandage already took effect. We'll put it on another bandage. We go back inside. We've got plenty of- no. Idiot. We got plenty of rage on us. Hopefully I don't need to dive out of the way right away. Ugh.
No, that's block. There we go. Why is he hitting me? Oh, I wasn't focused on him. Shit. I just made a very big mistake. No. Shit. No! <laughs> All right, we're taking our... I didn't even get this chance to see if I... I didn't even get a chance to see if I... If I did any damage to him. We've got healing potions. I'm going back in. Man, I really wanted to set all these traps. I love that he fucking walked over here. Like, what a jerk, man. God damn it, man, you're so fast! Ah, oh, and I missed him! No! No! Oh, and I gotta get my fucking bag. Dude! What is he fucking made out of? Oh my goodness! He's literally, he stopped swinging, I start swinging, and he started three new swings. Alright, I have to take another one of these. I have to go back in and get my... my stuff. Going back in one more time. I want to see what he looks like. I might try to drag him away from my bag so I can run away from him and grab my bag. Just block on him. I, I probably have more poise than he does, right? Stop it. Don't you get hit by anything. Man, look, he's so fast. Alright, we're gonna drag him away from my bag. He's got half health. I've got to be able to do something to him. Damn it, and he gets me, and he's so strong. Oh, got one. No, no! Son of a bitch, man. Dive! Oh, God. I cannot even half dive quick enough for this guy. Oh, it's over. Oh, 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 Jim, take a knee. Yes, get your breath back. Ooh, okay. What is this thing? What is this? It's not even anywhere near as bad as mine. Oh my god, dude, you better have so much good stuff in you. What is this, a scavenger coat? Meh. Meh. Eh, yeah, large emerald. All right, I'll take it. Let me get my trap back. Did I put a trap down? I did not. All right, well, you better have something in here for me. I think I've already been through this whole place. Oh, ho, ho. you son of a bitch. I want that hat. Give me that goddamn hat, you bastard. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, my God, man. I want to drag... I wish I could interact with dead bodies. I'm going to drag his body back to town. That'd be a lesson. Ugh, garbage in here. There's not even anything worth it. <laughs> you guys are the worst. Uh, oh, treasure hunt has been added to the journal. A treasure hunt's log has been updated. I've sailed the whole world, but my time has come. The treasure I leave is small, but it's valuable beyond compare. All right. If you believe yourself worthy of my legacy, start your journey by going inside my old ship's cabin buried in the sand. All right. All right, well, what we're going to do is we're going to head back to Cher Cherzo, I think. We're going to take a look. I mean, that the ship buried in the sand has to be the ship where the other treasure was, which we're, like, so close to. I may just walk over there. I just... It's a pirate skeleton, so it's going to be filled with fucking ghosts. All right, here's my thought. We're here. The ship buried in the sand is this thing. Gotta be. All right. All right. We're going... We're gonna stay out till we're tired. I'm not running all the way back home and all the way back out here. I think we're right here. So I gotta go back the way I came, come out. Oh, I gotta come all the way around and then come down here. We should probably be able to see it from right here. Right? Yeah, we should be able to see it from right here. I feel like that's it. Right there. Now that bandit camp is filled. Oh, I don't need to go that way. Uh, actually, that would be a shortcut. Let's go see if we can take a shortcut. The other option is that it's down here somewhere. Let's go take a look over the horizon and see if we can see any, um, boat cabins. Boat cabins. All right. Here's the edge of the beach. There are the rowboats that I think took us where we landed when we came back from inside the mountain and there's no boat cabins up there so here's the plan we're heading back around 
to where I think, over this way, where I think the boat cabin is. And if it isn't, the other place to check is this whole run of beach here. There's not a lot of sand in this game. I mean, it could be over here. Maybe. In theory. What is this? Yeah, you can't get over here without going through ghost hell. And we've already seen how well I do against skeletons. God, this is like Exonima all over again. <laughs> Alright, do I deal with you? I think I do. Can I hit you from here? No, I can't. We'll slide down this thing. Ha ha ha. He definitely... There's no way he didn't have all his health. So, I can officially... wreck these guys. Uh, I do not have a cook pot on me. Which is... What the fuck was that? Which is a good argument to carry one. I heard... I'm hearing swinging. There is a, a whole bunch of fighting happening. Right there. Oh, Jesus, they're all coming out of there. Can I go this way? Can. I did. Alright. Oh, you can't get out this way! I just made a mistake. I just trapped myself in here, but that's okay. You can't get out over here. This isn't a shortcut at all. Ugh. Alright, well, in for a penny. I'm gonna double check over here. Yeah, damn it, this is not a shortcut in the slightest. Well, we'll take a look at what they got. I didn't want to take the cook pot. Now I'm gonna be trapped here getting rid of the cook pot while they all walk back in the door. Oh boy. Fellas. Uh, let's check their treasure chest before any one of them sees me. I may have to fight a couple of them up here. Yeah, it's glowing again. Nice. Ooh, I forgot about that tripwire trap. Whoops. Or that, uh, pressure plate trap. <gasps> nice! What is this? Tiny aquamarine. I think I needed two of those for something. Bank shield. Bandages. We'll take everything. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright. These guys are fighting people. There's a lot of fighting happening. It sounds like it's Pearlbird fighting. We could probably use that opportunity to kill this one dude. While he's busy- while they're all busy. Oh, here's another dude. Alright, let's, uh, let's take care of him. Ah, I missed him and he got me! Real good, too! Why are you not- Block, you idiot! He's not blocking. What's happening? I can't block. I can't block. Oh, wait, did I break my controller? Oh, no. Jim won't block. He's not blocking at all. Or diving. There we go. Okay, there we go. Woo! That was a close one. And I let him hit me. And I didn't hit him. Oh, you are pushing my buttons, game. All right. Maybe a small malfunction with my controller right now, but we'll get through it. There we go. Oh, boy. Well, we can use those. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I couldn't block or dive. All right, I can dive again. Yay. Jeez Louise, that was scary. All right. Definitely block. There we go. We're blocking all the way. Oh, uh, this game needs a parry. <laughs> if you swing at the same time, even if it meant neither hit got through, just the the fact that both hits get through, mine and his, rather frustrating. <laughs> oh, things got a little worse out there, huh? All right. Oop, I want that machete. Bleed traps. All right. We're going to take a look in here and see if all this stuff has respawned. May as well, you know. Why not take advantage of it? Especially since I came this way... I guess by accident. You know, it might be nice while we're here, depending on how long I'm allowed to stay in Cherisonese without messing up this whole game, because I do not want to lose that house. Uh, it might be nice to take on the Wendigo in a controlled environment. I don't know if that's worse or better, but... Alright, I need none of that. I'll take your bird egg. Haha, uh -huh, you can't get... Oh. God damn it. Ah! Oh jeez, so scary. He made a scary noise. I can't hurt him through there, can I? Like... Oh, I bet he could hurt me. 
I can. Do I cheese this? Ah! Alright, let's let's take off our bag. I can't I can't um I can't uh I can't um lock onto him. Interesting. I don't mind doing this. <laughs> we'll see how many hits it takes. Which could be a good thing to learn out of all this. No, 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 no. Woo, hoo, hoo. Woo, okay. All right, what did he do? Frost damage. Hmm. All right. Let's get our stuff, because we're going to... How many do I have? I got the one. Let's take this. And let's put this on. And let's, uh, let's see if we can poison him. Oh, I shouldn't have put the poison on yet. I wanted to wait till I heal up a bit. Whoops. Well, why don't you uh, come look at me? All right, so he can definitely hit me through here. That's good to know. I bet that thing could hit me too, which would be scary. All right. All right, I think I'm poisoning him. Let's let that thing wear away. And just keep hitting him. And diving out of the way. No, 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 so scary, so scary. Man, he certainly takes a lot of hits. Okay, he hit me with a heavy amount of danger hell. <laughs> All right, let's put this on. I'm not taking my, um... I could probably remove that negative effect with this hex cleaner. Let's try it. Sure, here we go. Restores a bit of max stamina. I'm fine. Uh, we'll eat our jerky. We're still poisoned, which is good. Man, do they? I can't tell if he like restores health. But I don't know if. Uh, oh, it did. It did remove that. Um. Nope. No, oh, he got me. Ah, and he fuck. Okay, so don't use my special skills. Do not do that. We've learned a lesson. I'll tell you what we didn't learn a lesson about, because I'm an idiot, is, uh, what about this? I can't aim at him. Oh, I think I got him. Oh my god. How many is it gonna take? Oh no. I can never fight one of these. He took away like a quarter of my health. Is he dead? He's dead. All right. Well, we learned a very interesting lesson today. Wendigos are incredibly dangerous. No. Loot the Wendigo. Don't interact. Oh, but they give stuff. Oh, I got to give somebody a cold stone. So that's fantastic. And I got the bandit camp key. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh! That's a half a person. That person's not in half, but they're completely naked. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, my God. It's the same friggin' saber that What's Her Name gave me. Thanks. Uh, How long does this effect last? 151 seconds. All right, well, we got the key. Uh, Let's put our... Whatchamacallit back on. Not gonna get hurt stepping in here, right? Alright. Rush in without really paying attention. Ah, oh, come on. An assassin's elixir. A powerful concoction that temporarily increases your movement speed, stealth, and coats your weapon. Uh, coats your equipped melee weapon with poison. Nice. A ruby, another saber, and a brutal great axe, which we already have. We're gonna try to take all this stuff. It's gonna put us into crazy overweight territory. Okay. We're gonna step out of here, and it might be a problem. Because these guys might have assembled. I mean, I killed like three of them, I think. But... I don't know how many went after the bird. And there is a pistol shrimp out there that may have killed them. Which also means there's a pistol shrimp out there that may be a problem for me. We shall see. Oh, it's daytime. We're gonna be tired soon, huh? Alright, we're rushing out. Foolhardy. 
You know, I'm a little worried about going to the treasure. Uh, we'll have to make decisions while we're out there. We'll just make decisions. I don't want to run all the way back to Cherisini, so we can always come back out if we have to. I feel like this is going to be a treasure hunt and not just a handing of treasure, so... Not super worried. If it's a treasure hunt, there will be a an interim... <gasps> Fucker. Oh, boy. No, Jesus fucking Christ, man. He didn't even give a, a second to consider whether he wanted to hit me. Oh, thank God I moved. Let's try moving again. And one more time. And again. All right, he's far enough away. Man, he didn't even give a thought. He was just like, boom, you're dead, I don't care. All right, I want to check the map, but... Ugh. Yeah, up this way, I think. What am I looking at here? I think this is it. But yeah, that'll be the plan. We'll head out to what I believe is the right boat. So we're here. Yeah, we're gonna make a right and a right. Um, we'll head out to what I believe is the right boat. And I, I'm thinking... Uh, that this is going to be a multiple staged treasure hunt, and not just a treasure handoff. Um, if it's a treasure handoff, we'll make some decisions. If it's a treasure hunt, uh, maybe we'll have, uh, the next episode <laughs> will start after I have run home. Come back out. <laughs> to wherever the, uh, the next leg of the treasure hunt is. Also be nice to go in there. You know, it might be nice to like really actually poke around in here more than just the places that are already still giving me problems. I will tell you, I've definitely learned I am not prepared to mess with a Wendigo. That took like a hundred shots and multiple hits. It was multiple hits. I hit him with the axe. I hit him with the with the special, my brutal swing or whatever the hell it's called. Oh. Goodness. What other... I mean, it's a boat. It's in the sand. What else is there? Right? I mean, I see a captain's cabin. The question is going to be, can I get up there? And it looks like... I'm not... Don't you do it. It looks like I'm not getting up there by balancing. There's certainly no platforming. Dude, I will end your day. All right. Oh, is, uh, did, uh, what's his name? Is Zan's treasure refill? No, it didn't. It's not glowing. All right. First, we're just going to take a look at this. Can I walk up this? I can, sort of. I don't think I'm supposed to. This doesn't feel like what this game wants me to do. Yeah, no. It 100% does not want me to do it. Why is there so much? Oh, yeah, for sure. No, I can get up there. Yes, I can absolutely get up there. All right, we're going to check that out. But first, we're going to check this. Why is that glowing? Am I going to get in trouble for stepping over here? Uh, don't shock me. I'm just going to look in here, okay? Don't shock me. Nice. Thank you. All right. It's glowing for no reason. Whatever. All right. I'm like 99.99% sure I can do this. Ah, oh, we're gonna get up there. This is how you used to cheat your way into getting this backpack. Unless they've patched it, and you're not supposed to do this for sure, and I was never supposed to do the other thing. Can I just walk up here? No, I can't. What about here? Can I walk here? No. Maybe this isn't the- oh, here we go. What's this? Nope, can't go over there. Won't let me go over here. Interesting. Why would you make it look like I'm supposed to go? <laughs> You're killing me, game. All right, I'm gonna guess I'm not supposed to do this. All right. Come on, really? Really, nine dots? You make that look so enticing. I'm really not supposed to go up there. All right, I guess we have to go search the um, search the beach. On the other side of the island, or the other side of the map, I don't know if this is an island. We'll have to go search this beach, I suppose. We can also pay attention whilst I go home. 
this will be a good place to leave it. Man, I really wish we were able to get into this this boat, but I don't think we're supposed to. Um, I don't necessarily know that I want to spoil the treasure hunt, uh, so I probably won't poke around. And uh, what we'll probably do is just continue with our adventuring and eliminating of bandits and, and nasty people. Uh, but the goal might be, one of the goals of the next episode will probably be uh, running that stretch of beach and seeing if we find any uh, half-submerged uh, boats or captain's cabins. But subscribe for more Outward, because we'll definitely do that next week. And uh, we'll be back next time with Jim's Adventure.